Just another quick video picking up where the last video went left off. The last video is about getting tile map information so that you can manipulate it. So I was having issues in Godot 4 using set cell. It just flat out was not working. The, and so I redid everything in 3.5. Within 10 minutes, I had everything working exactly how I wanted it to, to work. So I knew what I was doing, which I still wasn't able to do in Godot 4. So after I got that all working, I was like, okay, going back to Godot 4 because I can have tile map layers. You can't have that in 3.5. So I figured out the set cell uh, and I figured it out by accident. Again, nothing online about any of this. If we look at our 2D map, this is the 2D map here. Uh, using the things from the last video, I have the coordinates starting at 0 to 0 all the way to here. This is the map. Uh, if I do an F6 here, right there, I found I, uh, the script as I have now takes a random number in X and a random number in Y, grabs the cell from there and replaces it with a water cell. This is the thing I couldn't get done. Because if you, for example, I think this is the one that's doing it. If we um, just comment that out and put that there. Let's kind of do that first. There we go. Now we run this again. Right there. That's our cell that we're replacing. But it's gray. Which means it is an undefined cell. I could not, for the life of me, figure this thing out. I'm doing everything uh, the way this thing shows. So set cell. It's a void, so it doesn't require anything... It doesn't, it's not an integer or anything, so it can be, it's just a function. Set cell, I've got the layer, it's layer zero. I, I got the coordinates in 2i, and there's my source ID. Why is it printing gray? It turns out you have to include, I'm not using an atlas um, tile grid, I'm using individual tiles. You still have to include the atlas coordinates of vector 2i. Uh, I'm guessing minus one, minus one, zero, zero works for me. So if we go back to the script and we do that, this includes, this is the Atlas uh, notification right there. I just have it as zero, zero. And that allows the tile to actually be grabbed and placed here without an invalid tile. I struggled with this for days and days, and I, I'm looking up information. Everybody is using, uh, in the first place, they're using their mouse pointer for information. Uh, get the coordinates with the mouse pointer. I'm like, I don't want to do that. I want to do it by X, Y. Well, that's, oh, that's just behind the... Uh, uh, and so I had to figure out most of the, most all of this myself, and I was pissed off about it. So here you go. To use set cell properly in the way that I'm using it with uh, non-atlas tile cells, you have to include this vector 2i, 0, 0, or... Well, let's try minus 1, minus 1. Where's my water? Apparently that didn't work. It's, it's random. I think. Yeah, minus one, minus one does not work. And we go back to zero. I accidentally used zero. I didn't use from the docs. And there's my water. Exactly. This is how you have to use set cell with non-atlas coordinates. I don't plan on using an atlas, so I have no idea how it works in atlases.